looking at how does interest rates affect you buying a home. Let's say you have house one and the home is going for $400,000 and you have an interest rate of 340,000, 3.40. So house one, the home price is 400,000, interest rate 3.40. If you do the calculations, this is not including your um, taxes. You're looking at $1,773.92 as a payment over 30 years. We're looking at a 30 year mortgage. If you go over and look at home two and you reduce the price, because some people say that the home prices are going down. So you go from 400,000, you go from three to 380. However, when you reduce the price, the interest rate is higher. So let's get the home price at 380, 4.40. That price comes to $2,003.04. Again, this is not including insurance, but what you see is that home price one is lower than home price two, even though the price at a house, home price two, is lower. All right? Let's look at this a step further. Let's take home price two and home price one. If you go over the life of the loan for 30 years, you will pay $721,094.40. Home price one, you have $638,611. So again, home price two is you're paying $721,094.40. For home price one, you have $638,000. And 600, 611 and 20 cents. The difference between those two is $82,000. $483.20. That's the difference you're paying over life for the loan over 30 years. So, again, the important takeaway is that interest rates matter. Why is it a good time to buy now? Because interest rates are at an all time low. So, some people would say, you know what, I'm not worried about interest rates, I am going to wait later on to buy a house when the home prices drop. However, you're waiting for home prices to drop, you may be in a position where interest rates go up and it causes your payments to still be more than they would have been here and you'll be paying more over the life of the, of the purchase.